hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here what's up my name is Tanika definitely make sure you subscribe so in this get ready with me I'll be showing you guys four Fenty Beauty products my mom bought these products for me a while back actually the day of the launch which was the 27th of May at Edgar's so this video is not sponsored but it'd be cool if it was I waited until now to try these products for you guys because I wanted to share my first impressions with you I'm getting ready for the Michelinie Influencer Talk Shop which will be today in a few hours actually right now it's 2.30 and I'm supposed to be like almost halfway done with my makeup right now i've been postponed with so many other things today anyway i'll be vlogging there as well so definitely make sure you subscribe and you don't miss this vlog because this vlog is going to be so cool guys like ah! <laughs> also make sure to turn on my post notifications so you'll be notified when that vlog is uploaded or when i post it or yeah when it's on youtube basically <laughs> i'm gonna start my makeup with my brows like i usually do um am i talking fast I should probably slow the heck down. In my previous get ready with me, you would have re realized that I had this like super, super small pencil. It was like so funny to me because like I used to always forget <laughs> buying a new one and I finally got the chance to buy it today for this video because I knew I was going to get ready on camera. I bought it at Signature Standard. It was $52. I really hope you guys can see anyway yeah I didn't know like since or oh, I don't know when brow pencils started to become so expensive because this was $52 and last I checked it was like at least 30 40 so on the launch date it was the most funniest thing because there were so many women in that section of Fenty and it was wild guys like it was wild oh my gosh it's a little bit darker than i'm used to anyway like edgar's had this nice special where you'd receive um 200 dollars 250 dollars discount with every two products you bought and for me since i bought four or my mom bought it for me since i got four it was 500 dollars discount in total yeah so like it was really good buying it that day plus that special was only um available to the first hundred shoppers and i need a sharpener already Shiza. anyway um it was only available to the first hundred shoppers and also i think it was one o'clock so if you went at two it wouldn't be available whether they reached the 100 shoppers or not and i just felt like it wasn't advertised well enough initially because i didn't know it would end at one and had you gone at two and you thought it was like the first hundred shoppers and stuff you would not get the special but anywho i'm glad i did my sister also got some fenty products she's been using hers and I've just been basically waiting until this day to do it for you guys. So, this brow looks really... I don't even know what I'm doing, guys. Oh my gosh. Anyway, I, I'm happy with this one. But this one, I don't know. But you know what's so funny? In the beginning, I would end up liking one. And then when I'm done, it's like the total opposite. I don't like the one that I initially liked. So let me show you guys the first product. This is the bag that I got the makeup in. Okay. So the first product obviously will be the foundation because I needed to clean my brows and just set my face. Um you guys notice I don't usually use primer and stuff like that. I don't know. I don't own one. I need to get one anyway we make use of what we have um so this is the foundation okay i bought the foundation in the color 345 i tried to kind of match it the best i could in the store <laughs> i wanted to invest in a good foundation since the last one i mean the one that i do own i've had since 2017. i wanted to invest in a good foundation and i think that i did just that with this one 
hopefully Rihanna leaves a tiny message on all her products that she you know all her products anyway this one says medium to full coverage for all long way lightest air that's what it says Florence one of my subscribers Ooh. Anyway, Florence, one of my subscribers, said that she mixes her foundation and her concealer to clean up her brows. So I think I'm going to give that a try today. I actually really wanted to give it a try. Um, yeah, I really hope that it turns out good for me. I'm just going to mix the two on my hand because why not? Okay. This is it on its own. I'm trying to think about like this. They look almost identical. Oh my gosh. Ha! <laughs> okay. I'll be mixing. Two. Three. Guys, I'm making a mess. Okay. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna start with my bad eye because I need to do some heavy lifting here. Oh my gosh, this is so bomb. <laughs> Not me coming with my happy face. Oh wow. You see, I knew this was gonna happen. I'm now in love with the eyebrow that I... Oh my gosh, it's perfect. I still have my bushy hair right now, so... I don't know how to style it at this point <laughs> as it wasn't just going as a normal afro Ooh, you see this guys oh my gosh oh my gosh I wish I could match oh my gosh it's so perfect okay I'm gonna go in the other one but I actually want more pencil now I think that's good i really enjoy filming get ready with me for you guys because i feel like i get to really be myself and not that i'm not myself in the other videos but it just feels like i'm taking you guys with me the whole entire process it feels like i'm talking to my besties while you know getting my makeup done and i feel like I never really saw myself doing this at the start of my YouTube when I decided to have a YouTube channel I didn't think that oh my gosh yeah get ready with me and all that jazz I didn't think I would be doing that initially but after my first get ready with me it was like oh my gosh that was so much fun I think I got the right shade guys so just making more of the mixture oh my gosh thank you florence for putting me on guys if you guys have more makeup tips that you want to you know advise me on then please comment down below because i'm feeling this i have to wash my hands before i do a lot of other things today okay i think i'm done with my brows for now i need to wipe this situation off so i'll be back because i don't want to ruin or dirty anything it's gonna be applying foundation everywhere else i don't usually go for a uh, full coverage so i'm just gonna try to be as light as possible oh wow the way it applies it feels like lotion seriously oh wow and i just applied like a little piece on my hand and honestly a little goes a long way like okay and it doesn't even look like i really have foundation on and this is before i even spray my setting spray this is usually the look i get after my spreading spray Okay. Ah! I'm super excited guys. Anyway, 
to conceal and contour i'll be just i'll be using um what's the thing i'll be using signature i have this color okay that's not the one i contour with this is the one i contour with i use in i use it in the color fudge in the color fudge i just be contouring with this concealer i usually put it here and i put it oh my gosh it feels so good <laughs> So I usually just imagine drawing a triangle on my face like that and then like that so I'm just trying to match both sides now I'm gonna let that sit for a while and then I'm gonna just contour my nose I'm not really good at contouring my nose yet I'm just gonna be highlighting my eyes why do I say highlight conceal with this LAK Pro concealer? Being done before. Got water. Pretty. I think in my next get ready with me, I want to do um, a chit chat get ready with me. Either way, I answer questions that you guys have um, that I can answer on camera for you guys while doing my makeup. Or, but the thing is, I'd have to do the poll on my Instagram, and I think some of you guys don't follow me on my Instagram, so please follow me on my Instagram so we can interact more. They almost post like almost every day on the stories, and yeah, then we get to interact basically. Okay, the so second product was this liquid highlighter thingy it was a difficult purchase to make because i've never um had a product like this before like i basically never had um a liquid highlighter like this and i just feel like i mean the lady highly recommended it to me and that's why i got it so i'm not sure if i'm gonna like this one this is how it looks outside the box <laughs> okay but the lady highly recommended to me she's like 10 out of 10 and this is the one you have to color match it with your um foundation because you have to mix this highlighter with your foundation and then you apply it on your skin so that's how basically it works so i hope i get it right okay this one is called um liquid kilowatt and it's in the color hustle baby 2.0 003 i don't know that's what it says guys what she left on this one is liquid lumosity sets pretty endless ways to glow that's basically what it says okay let's give this baby a try just gonna mix it on my hand again so i put this is how it looks on my hand i'll be using it in the inner corner of my eyes and i'll be using it to highlight my brows because i usually put a little bit of highlighter there as well i think that's how i'm gonna use it today i'm just gonna wait for it to set a little i really don't know how to use this product though <laughs> my nose is completely highlighted for the makeup look i'm gonna do today i haven't done before it's basically i'm gonna be arranging gems around my eyes in a shape of a wing basically it will make sense once i'm done hopefully this is the gems i'm using today i got it from clicks and that day it was on a special it, i know it's meant for like nails and stuff but i'm just gonna use it for my face down because yeah Ooh. Thank you. 
so guys i just finished putting on the gems um this is basically the makeup look i'm going for let me just try to come up close to you guys you can see this is my first time putting on gems or using gems as makeup so i think i did a pretty good job definitely go check my other get videos of me to see how i put on my lashes i'm just gonna quickly do it off camera and then i'm gonna show you guys the third fenty product so i got my lashes on the third fenty product that i'm gonna be showing you guys is the normal highlighter this is the kilowatt highlighter um this is how it looks outside the box this is the packaging it is in the color um it's in the color girl next door and chick freak and i'll be using it on my cheeks and to highlight my nose more i'll probably also use it to um highlight my cupid spell um just before i put on my gloss i'm almost done with my makeup and i'm so happy so this is how it looks outside the box okay i don't have the appropriate um highlighting tool i go in with this tool this one kind of looks like that at the end and yeah the fb looks so good i think it's too much okay. the reason why i decided to take this highlighter as well is because i just wanted like a normal standard um highlighter the reason why i got this one is because it was like there's like a duo highlighting thing going on and the message rihanna left is it says creamy long lasting endless ways to glow that's what she said on this one okay so a little bit on my nose i think that's actually a lot on my nose and then i'm gonna use a little bit on my cheeks The side's makeup is giving. Ah. Oh my gosh. It's hella pretty. I'm using, today I'm using Cheek Freak. I think I'll use Girl Next Door on another day. What I'm using to bake today is the Signature Loose Powder Translucent. This one is really good. I really, when I bought it, I didn't find anything wrong. It. I love the color of the powder because I think even my sister uses it and she loves it. She really like loves it as well. It's eighty dollars in signature. If you guys are interested, ooh, I did that one perfect. I also like to put it on my chin because I feel like it enhances my facial features. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for this to bake for now and then. Oh, child, I'll be looking cute, cute. I'll be waiting for this to bake and then I'm gonna go in with the last 20 product. I want to line my lips with the with my brown pencil and see how that turns out. If I don't like that look, then. I'll just wear the um, the glass foam as its own. Just gonna blend out the powder real quickly. Ooh, my powder has set. Should I use blush today? Let me go in with some blush, honey. The blush palette I'm using is from Foschini. Okay, let me just quickly get this done. She's using some blush today. So, let me just line my lips real quick. Okay, this is the famous glass balm. It's it, the glass balm heat. Um, this product, I actually, this is the only product I have tried before. Um, I had to try it on in store. I just, I just had to. Um, this color is in chocolate heat, 
hot chocolate heat. Okay, so now I'm gonna try it on. This is outside the packaging. This is how it looks. Okay, let me. It's said to have some menthol properties which leaves a tingle on your lips. And that tingle or the menthol properties is supposed to make your lips more plump. Ooh, oh my gosh, this looks so good. I'll definitely be having this in my handbag. Okay, guys. <coughs> oh, yeah. And the message that she left on this one, I almost forgot to tell it to you guys. It says, for the full effect. Oh, my gosh. She was right, child. It looks so good. Oh, and I don't know, some, you know, lipsticks have a taste. This one tastes so good also because, like, there's just some parts that touch your tongue and it's just so pleasant. Anywho, right now <clears throat> so this is the finished makeup look yo guys i'm almost ready at this point i just have to do my hair i was debating whether i wanted to do it on or off camera but since this is a get ready with me i was gonna do it on camera for you guys my cousin is currently um, ironing my jacket. This is basically the fit. I'll show you guys a full view at the end. I'm supposed to wax, but I don't think this is that bad. I I'm just gonna go like that today because let me just try to do my hair now. Yo, this table is a mess right now. I'm not showing you guys on purpose. Okay. Yeah, so I usually just stretch out the hair like this. You can see in this movement. Oh, that's. That keeps on falling. I don't even know. Behind the scenes of looking fabulous, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> um, so I just do this to the hair. I just stretch it out, stretch it out, stretch it out, stretch it out. This, and then I pull a bunch of hair to the front. That's what I usually do. But I'm thinking I want to pull hair to the front and pin it. I, don't, I want my makeup to show today. So I have these. I got these from Pep. How do I open this? Oh, they're like that. See? Okay, let's on the tape was. Oh, okay. So I was thinking this would look good with the suit. So something like. It hurts. Put it on this side. Maybe I can pin it on the far corner like this. Oh, Shoo! Sure. Aina! Okay, guys, so I'm almost done. I'm using this perfume. Just wanted to share it with you guys. Using this perfume for today. Oh, it smells so good. I'll also be having it in my handbag the whole night. You can tell my lips is off. I need to do it again. Okay. This is me. So this is the third. This is the third. I'm basically just wearing one of my Fashion Nova outfits that was in my Fashion Nova haul that's currently live on my channel. Check it out. Okay, guys, this is the final look, and I really hope that you guys enjoyed this Get Ready With Me. I'll leave the link to the entire catalog um, of the Fenty Beauty line in the description box if you're interested to check um, prices or the availability in Edgar. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Of course, subscribe. Definitely put on my post notification so you'll be notified every single time I upload a video. I'll see you guys in my next video and I love you guys so much. Mwah.